Hello there, great people. I hope you are doing well. Greetings from Portugal. My name is Nuno. Today the video is Mac OS uh, Mojave. It is the second beta. So today is the 19th of June uh, 2018 and uh, Apple just released the iOS 12 beta 2, uh, Watch OS, Mac OS Mojave. I already posted two videos on the iPhone 8 and iPad Air first generation regarding iOS 12. And now let's go ahead and dive right in in macOS Mojave with the second beta. As you can see here on system preferences, we have something similar now like iOS. So if we click here, uh, it is the you know system update or software update, I'm sorry. So let's check it. Here we are with the second update of this Mac. So uh, I'm going to install this beta. I will check here, by the way, uh, what is, I have uh, almost, okay, 229.91 gigabytes available. Let's see after the, the, the update how how it is the storage and let's see if there is something new so let's go ahead start and uh, I'll be right with you so it's about two and a half gigabytes okay on a MacBook Pro 15 inch mid 2015 so I'll be right back with you very well guys so uh, just a quick note i decided to you know to to make a, a separation on the videos the first one as you can see uh, it was on the 19th uh, and uh, today is the 21 so the first part of the video was in fact all the installation and uh, i decided to wait two days to check, uh, you know, for performance, bugs and everything and make a uh, all-in-one video. So uh, keep in mind that if you know the different dates, one was on the 19th, the day that Apple released the second beta for macOS Mojave, and this one is on the 21. So two days after the installation, uh, you know, I can already tell you uh, about the performance that I have already here, the Geekbench that I will talk in a little while and also the bugs. Now guys, uh, there are more bugs for me, okay, in this second release of macOS uh, beta, macOS Mojave beta 2, so the second release, then uh, on the on the first one keep in mind for you that haven't seen the my first video on the better one that i have this installed on my primary system okay go ahead call me a fool i know but i want to test it you know with all my applications and everything and if you know ever you know something goes wrong i always have my backups of my important data now let's go ahead for the major bug that i encountered my mac when it goes to sleep uh, it doesn't wake up so uh, you know i have to force uh, the shutdown in the power button and that's not good okay that's not good at all of course i made a bypass to that uh, uh, when i go to power savings i uh, you know don't allow for the computer to go to uh, standby or sleep mode when the monitor is off okay uh, i have my macbook uh, connected to an apple cinema display as you saw on my other videos you guys that are subscribed subscribe it and uh, you know uh, i don't of course i don't want always to you know force shut down my computer it is not good i can corrupt the file so keep that in mind uh, and keep keep just to keep you a little bit aware that uh, don't install this on your primary system okay i did it in order to make videos for you okay but don't don't do it at this point in time you know i've encountered this bug you can encounter another one so uh this and also uh when it goes to sleep it doesn't charge my devices okay the usb ports that don't work and they did on the first beta and then did on mac os they did it on mac os i sierra so keep that in mind for me this is a major bug i made a bypass on that but uh, if you encounter this issue keep that in mind now 
regarding all the features you know you have all the same things that you had on the first bet of macOS Mojave everything is there you know the dark mode the dynamic wallpaper uh, you know the dock if you want to have the recents shown on your dock as you can see here I'm recording this with screen flow so I can uh, if I don't want that to show I don't want that so I don't have that enabled so uh, regarding security and privacy you have of course the same thing with your camera and microphone for you to check what are the you know the, th the what what is using your you know your camera microphone and photos and everything so um, still there still present regarding iCloud uh, you still have uh, let me see here if there isn't uh, if there is anything new no still the same thing as macOS Mojave Beta 1 I'm sorry for repeating myself um, and uh, here that is in fact a small change only on the icon okay if in beta one it was a different icon so everything remains the same now let's go ahead to the same to to see if there isn't there is any change regarding the voice memos uh, there isn't anything new i still cannot uh, you know erase there isn't anything here to erase my my recordings okay you can only replace or make okay even if i go to edit the you know it's not highlighted the erased so if you want to do it since this is synced with my i my ios devices the iphone and the ipad you have to erase there so probably this no i'm sure it will be fixed and they will have a button to erase okay now um if we go to the stock apps everything remains the same also nothing new here okay everything remains the same and uh, there is uh, the news app here in portugal is still present i don't have this on my iphone or ipad apple news but it's uh, here on my mac okay so this is uh, what i can tell you one more thing final cut still crashes a lot so um, uh, i think apple today released a new build if i go here to mac rumors so i hope this uh, new build it, here, here it is this new build so the 10 point dot four dot three uh fixes that okay so keep guys keep that in mind if you have applications that you rely again uh, don't install these betas okay on your primary system now let's go ahead to performance that's one thing that you like to see the beta one guys was you know very very impressive it was about uh, 1000 more on multi-core score okay i had in pre the previous build the beta one about um uh, on, on on high sierra about almost 14 okay almost for, uh, 14 thousand and on this one in fact is a little bit it's 1000 more uh, higher and that's that's a lot okay and the single core score remains the same regarding the beta 2 it was a small decrease uh, the 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 single core score is the same as beta 1 and on the multi-core score you know a slight uh, decrease nothing nothing major nothing that you can see on a rec on your normal usage just a quick note i uh, i made a, a geek bench yesterday yesterday the 20th uh, and it was about 13 uh, so um, 13 800 so 1000 less uh, i didn't took a screenshot of that but you know uh uh, I don't know. I haven't seen any decrease on performance. Now, regarding the good things, uh, it seems very, very fluid. Okay, everything works well. Safari works well. All the stock stock apps work without any flaws. Uh, for you know uh, privacy reasons, I will not show you my photos and everything. But everything seems to work. You know, iTunes, Spotify, books. But as you can see uh this is uh you know i don't know what this is uh 
allow access to privacy okay 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 uh, then I will allow that uh, if we go here to uh, library so it remains the same everything works okay without any flaws uh, third-party apps like deleting my apps uh, also work um, now let's see Skype if that is uh, if it is working on the iPhone it doesn't work it seems to work here okay very well I don't use Skype but if you do so guys this is I don't want this video to be too long honestly when I talk about Mac OS my videos are a little bit longer than on uh, the iPhone or the iPad but for you that are interested you know uh, I'd like to make all these uh, you know explanations about what what's happening so guys this is it if you have any questions uh, if you want to see any uh, other information that i didn't cover on this video go ahead leave and leave it on the comments guys thank you uh, once again for stopping by and thank you for coming back for you subscribers and of course you guys new guys for stopping by and see uh, my videos and my channel and uh, i will keep you posted uh, on you know the ios uh, 12 beta 2 that i already released the first videos and i'll do the follow-up you know on you know reliability bugs and everything so without further rambling uh, thank you so much for for watching and i will see you very very soon bye bye